What's up Cherry Blossom family? Welcome back to the channel. If you're new here, hi, my name is Jessie, also known as Miss Cherry, and guys, have I got a kind of a strange and fun video for you. <laughs> this is a video like I have never done before. I am combining two of my most favorite things. Late 90s, early 2000s nostalgia, and Disney, and we're marrying the two. And we are creating a really fun craft project that I am dying <laughs> to do. just love this idea. So I grew up in the 90s and early 2000s and the mascot of my childhood is a Furby. <laughs> I would love to know, did you play with Furbies? Are these something that you had in your childhood? So Furbies, what they are, they are an electronic toy made by Tiger Electronics. And this is actually a Furby baby. This is the smaller version. There's a larger version uh, that's a regular size Furby. This is Bertrand, by the way. His name is Bertrand. And he is... He's basically an exact replica of the larger version. So he is on a tilt, so you can place batteries inside of him. He takes four double A's and he can tilt back and forth. You can pet him on his back and then press his tummy and also feed him in his little mouth and his eyes move up and down. And then if you have another Furby, you can actually put them together and they communicate through this magic I don't even know what it is, but they talk back and forth. Now, I remember taking these to school when I was younger and like sitting them next to my friends Furby and they never really like actually communicated. They just made a significant amount of noise at one another, which to us was probably the coolest thing ever. <laughs> and so I got to thinking one day, I'm like, man, doesn't Bertrand look very much like Zac Efron? Look at those baby blues. I mean, seriously though, like isn't he the most handsome Furbs? And so I was thinking, I'm like, we should make him into Troy Bolton. I never really fell in love with High School Musical until I was an adult, and when I did, I fell hard. I love High School Musical 1, 2, and 3. They are so fun, and I decided that, you know what? We're gonna turn my little Furbs we're gonna turn Bertrand into Troy Bolton. So we're gonna make him a basketball jersey today that says Wildcats, uh, go EHS. And then <laughs> we are going to also give him a little, uh, a little photo shoot, maybe do a couple of TikToks with him. I just thought it would be really fun. I'm gonna take you along today as I make his outfit and kind of figure out what we wanna do. But before we get into that, I wanna tell you a little bit about my friends over at Magic Plus. They just released this really cool high school musical t-shirt that is a combination of Soren the Ride and the Breaking Free song from High School Musical. It says, we're Soren, we're flying, and it's got all the different places on Soren that you can visit. It's available in their shop today. They're releasing it on this video date, which is so fun. And I will link them down below. Also, I have a promo code for them and it's cherry25 to get 25% off. I'm also wearing in celebration of this video, my Furby earrings from I'm Your Present on Etsy. These ears are from Pixie Dust Ear Designs. Thought I would give you a whole outfit spiel, but thank you again to Meg at Magic Plus for sending this over to me. And I'm so excited to be able to help you launch that today with this really silly video. So I'm gonna show you some of the supplies today that I got for Bertrand to turn him into Troy Bolton and then talk about like our game plan. So first I want to start with his jersey. So I'm just using a regular iron-on transfer vinyl that's in white to make his little Wildcats logo. And then I got cotton fabric. This cotton fabric is red with little white dots. I thought it looked very jersey-esque because I couldn't find an actual jersey material, you know, like with the holes in it that would actually work. So I went with this instead. And then I also got some binding. This is just like white, uh, white fuzzy binding. And I thought it would be a really nice, uh, a really nice outline to go onto the jersey itself. Now Bertrand has a really big tail. So unfortunately his number is not going to fit on his back because we have only about like, uh, I would say maybe an, it, well, maybe not even an inch to work with on the back. So it's just gonna really fasten behind him. So we're gonna really focus on his little V-neck, on his 
belly and also the Wildcats logo like on his chest. Now I did find this amazing world's smallest Nerf basketball hoop from Box Lunch and this is going to be Bertrand's basketball uh, for his Troy Bolton outfit. And then we are also going to be doing a little hairstyling with him too. I'm still trying to decide how we're going to do it. I may do like a little bit of hairspray. You know, we have to get like this Zac Efron do, right? <laughs> <laughs> so dreamy back in the day. Oh, looking like a duck. You remember that haircut? Guys, I've got some measuring to do and some creating to do, so why don't we go ahead and go into it. I will walk you through my exact process and then I will show you the finished product at the very end, so let's get into it. Since there's no patterns for Furbies, I'm clearly <laughs> making my own. I did some basic measurements to make sure I kind of understood like how tall he was and, and the information about like where I think his jersey should go. Then I ended up just wrapping this fabric around him and just making cuts around him because I thought that that was the best way to go about it. The shape of this jersey was kind of odd because I had to accommodate for his ears and his tail and his front feet, but I think I got a good shape and now I'm cutting out the binding and getting this ready to go on the outline of the jersey. And now it's time to sew. I'm sewing the edges down and then I am also sewing the binding to outline the entire jersey. <laughs> okay, to say this is the best use of craft supplies that I own is an understatement. Like we are, we made a baby jersey. Oh my gosh, this is hilarious. Okay, so I'm gonna snip the edges off and then it's gonna be time to pick out like what we're gonna put on the front of I think I want the jersey that's in the very first movie. So I think I'm going to try to emulate that, but this is everything. This is turning out. <laughs> okay, so I've opened up my Cricut design space, but this is kind of what I'm thinking of for my Zephron like jersey, right? So we want it to say Wildcats 14. I just think the Furby's so small that like I'm not going to be able to fit this tiny Wildcat. So we're just going to try to go for just the Wildcats 14 and see if that works. And then this is the hair and spo. So we will work on that in just a little bit. But first we're making the Wildcats and then we're moving on to some hairstyles. The imprint is so small that I couldn't find a font that was going to work that would allow for the outline. So I just went with this basic font. And then the Wildcats has a little bit of a curve to it, but not too much because the space that we are able to actually iron on is only a little under one inch tall. It's time to iron on the absolute tiniest iron on transfer I've ever used. I couldn't use my Cricut press because it was too big. So I had to use the very tip of the iron to press on and iron on this tiny Wildcats number 14 to the jersey. Question is, why was this a haircut? How did this pass the test? Also, did you know someone with this haircut or did you have this haircut? Basically everyone that I knew had this type of hairstyle back in the day and it was so funny and everyone loved it so much. <laughs> Okay, friends, are you ready for the big reveal? To be fair, I am not 100% sure you're going to be able to tell the difference between him and the real Zac Efron, but guys, <laughs> present to you Zephron. Friends, so his hair, <laughs> I tried my hardest with his hair. His hair is really short, so I couldn't quite get the swoopy swoop that I was looking for, but can we talk about this jersey? and his beautiful eyes. We'll do a spin so you can see the whole action. <laughs> I swear to you, this made my heart sing. If you, I present to you, here is a little better look at Bertrand as Troy Bolton. There is his little Nerf hoop. It fits him so perfectly his little Wildcats jersey. And then I'm gonna cut to a clip now of a really silly little TikTok that he and I did together. If you're not following me over on TikTok, I would love for you to join me. It's under the username at Miss Jessie Cherry and I will link it down below for you guys but to check out. But I hope that you enjoy this silly video. I gotta go my own way. What about us? What about everything we've been through? Oh, what about trust? You know I never wanted to hurt you. And what about me? What do you think of Zac Efron slash Bertrand?
Bertrand. Did he turn out okay? Did you guys like his outfit? If you would like to see more of me making Disney costumes for my Furbies, please let me know down below. <laughs> this might be a one and done, guys. This might be a one and done. If you enjoyed this video, please give it a thumbs up. Also, be sure to subscribe down below for lots of fun videos just like this one. TTFN, bye!